today I'm going to be putting this docking kit right here. It's a Harley Davidson part on my motorcycle so that I can put a sissy bar or a rack or something like that on it. And I've already removed the bag. And of course, we got to take these things here off. I've already loosened them up just a little bit. We're going to go ahead and I'm going to take these off one at a time, stack the bolt and put it back on. And that sort of solves two problems because right behind here, there's a piece that both of these screw into. If you take them both off, that piece is going to fall. And you can look up several YouTube videos where people do this and all of a sudden you hear clink, 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 and that's that piece falling down. By the way, this is a T45. You're gonna need a T45 to take them off and then an, I think it's an Allen going back in. I'll see how the bolts work, if I'm gonna reuse the old ones or use the new ones. You might also wanna use a drop cloth if you're scared you're gonna hit any of this. There are instructions that come with it. You can read them if you want, I usually do. In the kit, you're gonna get some bolts and you're gonna get some spacers. I'm not using these bolts. They're not long enough, but the factory one should be long enough. And the spacers are two different sizes. The big one goes to the rear and the small one goes to the front. You're gonna to wanna to clean the Loctite off, but as you see, this slides right off. And this slides on. And then we screw it back in, but I'm gonna clean that Loctite off and put fresh on there. I'm just gonna snug these up. I'm not gonna torque anything down. And I'm gonna make sure everything fits before I actually put some torque on it. By the way, if I didn't mention it, use blue Loctite, don't use the red Loctite. That will cause you a lot of problems in the future. And also, if you have a 9mm bore brush, if you happen to have firearms, that works really good for cleaning the threads. The On the inside, those threads. And there you can see both sides, the docking kit is installed. I'll try to zoom in here for you. That's the big one. And that's the little one. Same on the other side. And when I get a rack or something for it, I'll put it on and I'll show you what it looks like.
So I took it for a test drive. Um, nothing fell off. Everything's mounted securely. And it's all good. So that's how you put a docking kit on a Harley Davidson. This one's a 2023 Lowrider ST. And I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like and subscribe. And my next video should be the bunking high step crash bars, but they're not going to be here for another two weeks. And when I get them, I'll be putting out another video on how to install them. So stay tuned for more and I'll catch you later. Bye.